It's a continuation of our uh, new technology to prevent sea critters from attaching themselves to all manner of uh, ships and docks and anything that is immersed in ocean water. Most people will be real familiar with whenever they look at something that's been out of water, it's covered in barnacles, and algae, and fouling is the general term for this. So obviously the Navy is very interested in reducing or eliminating that because when that happens on their ships or any ship for that matter, you have to pull the ship out of the water, put it into dry dock, pressure wash the whole thing, clean it up, repaint it maybe, and then put it back. So they'd like to be able to avoid doing that too frequently. The fouling causes a lot of loss in efficiency, which means you have to burn more fuel to go the same distance. If you can prevent fouling, you can conserve fuel. It's good for the environment, it's good for the bottom line. It's also good for the estuaries because currently many of the paints they use have toxic materials in them, but ours is different. You can think of it as a glassy gel. It's got a bunch of water in it, so things don't stick to it because they think they're trying to stick to water. And our material is really good at repelling or preventing the adhesion of proteins. We want to be able to present our best coating, and that is what the research is all about. So we'll do some small-scale testing, and then when we've got something we really think works well, then that goes into the field.